Oh, you guys, I just got Tron on Blu-ray. You gotta come over soon so we can watch it. How about now? Yeah, it's not like we have anything else going on right now. We're just sitting around drinking coffee. Yeah, let's go watch Tron. I've been dying to see what it looks like on Blu-ray. We can't go over to my place right now. Why not? Well, my place, it's, uh, it's really messy right now. I, I wouldn't want you guys to see what it looks like and think less of me. Robbie, that's absurd. We couldn't possibly think any less of you than we do already. Besides, your place is always messy. Yeah, ever since that maid you hired quit after you sexually harassed her. You guys know I have a thing for people who clean for a living. We know, but that doesn't mean you can slip naked pictures of yourself into her bag. Hey, it was just a little innocent flirting. I thought she'd get home, maybe open the bag, find the picture, and hopefully come back over to my place for some late night polishing. How was I supposed to know she was going to donate the bag to Goodwill after she left my house? I mean, we were both embarrassed by the whole thing. I imagine it was more embarrassing for you. I heard somebody who saw the picture that that it must have been pretty cold when he took that photo. Ha ha. Seriously, let's go watch Tron. We can't go to my place right now. Why? What are you hiding? My... my... okay, well, my sister's in town visiting and she's staying at my place this weekend. So? When I left the house, she said she was going to sit in the backyard for some sunbathing. Nude sunbathing. Your sister? Which sister? Katie. Katie? Your sister, Katie, the 22-year-old yoga instructor, is sitting in your backyard naked and we don't want to see that? That's my sister. And you guys have known her for years, so I would imagine she's like your sister, too, at that point. I just figured that because of that, it would be gross for you guys, too. Okay, I can understand your reasoning there. Tell you what. We should go over there, look at her, and see if she does, in fact, make us feel gross because she's so much like our own sister. You know, be scientific about it. I have to concur with Dean. After all, I'm a big fan of science. Hey, hey, Finn, what's your favorite kind of science? Hmm. I think I'd have to say anatomy, Dean. <laughs> yeah, yes, <laughs> me too. There's another reason we should go say hello to your sister. It'd be like a lesson in anatomy. Besides, it's been so long, I'm sure she'd be happy to see us. I know she'd be happy to see you two. I don't think she'd be so happy about you seeing her naked. There's only one way to find out. It's not going to happen, Dean. Okay, fine. We were just kidding anyway. We would really like to watch that copy of Tron, though. Well, I guess we could go to my place and get the movie, then bring it over to your house, Ben. And we could watch it up there. Your stereo system is better than mine anyway. So I'll pick it up and meet you guys at the back of Fens in about half an hour. Actually, my car's broken down again, and I think I better just come with you to your place where you can grab Tron, and then we can head over to Fens to watch it. Are you for real? You still don't have a car that works? We're six episodes into the show, and your car still won't run? Yep, I'm still walking through the woods every day. Yikes, what about the woodsman? He disappeared a few weeks ago. I haven't seen him. I guess he moved on to protect the forest somewhere else. But I'm still going to need a ride, Robbie, so let's go right over to your place to get the movie. Yeah, I should go with you guys. Why the hell do you need to go? You have a car? Uh, I do have a car, but the, uh, my, my tags are expired. And I'm trying not to drive it around too much until I get new ones. So I would love it if I could ride with you guys over to your house to pick up the movie. Then we'll go straight to my place. Fine, but you guys are staying in the car when we get to my house. I'm just gonna run in and run back out, Okay. Stay in the car. I'll be right back. Of course we'll stay in the car. And don't change the presets to my radio to country stations like you did last time. You know I can't stand country music. Hey, Katie. 
Hey, Katie. Oh, hey, guys. It's so good to see you. Robbie didn't tell me you were coming over. Let me see if I can get up out of this chair so I can waddle over to you guys and give you a big hug. No, no, no. Don't don't go to any trouble. Yeah, we'll, we'll hug later. Aw, you guys are embarrassed because I'm not wearing anything. Isn't that cute? It's just the human body, boys. It's nothing to be embarrassed about. I'm certainly not ashamed. Yeah, it's just a little weird because we think of you as a sister. That's so sweet, Dean. So you're... you're... Knocked up? Yeah, did Robbie not tell you guys? No, I, I guess he forgot to mention it. It must have slipped his mind. The doctor says I'm having triplets. Wow, you don't say. I know, it's so exciting. Except for the fact that I'm so huge right now. Nah, you look, you look good. Great, even. You two are so nice to say that, but let's be honest here. I'm pretty huge. You guys remember what I looked like when I came out to visit for Halloween? You mean when you dressed up as Wonder Woman? No, that was two years ago. Oh, when you were dressed as the, uh, naughty nurse. No, you guys have terrible memories. That was three years ago I dressed as the naughty nurse. Last year, I was the Golden Princess Leia bikini, remember? Oh, yeah. I mean, remember how hot I looked in it? Can you imagine me wearing that gold bikini looking like this? It's unfortunate, but I'll probably never get my body back the way it was. Guys, I told you I was coming right back into the car. Come on. We gotta go. It was great seeing you guys again. We should all have dinner one night before I have to go back home. Yeah, great. We'll do that. You, you, you didn't tell us she looks so very pregnant. Oh, uh, yeah. Some loser guy she's dating back home did that to her. Our parents are pissed, which is why she decided to come out here for a few days to get away from them. Uh-huh. Oh, no. What's wrong? This copy of Tron I have is an imported version from China or someplace like that. It's not compatible with your Blu-ray player. Oh, that sucks. Well, we could just watch something else, then. Okay. You know what I've been in the mood to watch? Return of the Jedi. No! No! no. What? What's wrong with you guys? It's a classic. You, know, you love Return of the Jedi. I, I don't think I'll ever be able to watch Return of the Jedi again. 